Yes. Four straight game over 88 points. Are, are you getting better offensively? You feel like you're getting the shots you want. Our ball movement and and our movement in general is a lot better. Um, we were taking hard shots, and we don't need to take hard shots. We got enough guys that can make shots that we can spread people and and uh, get step in shots. Coach Wednesday, you said that the team was playing out of out of game plan, out of structure. And you think that was a lot better today? It was better offensively. Defensively, we still we still don't know what we're doing. They, they, the the rule changes have made it harder to guard for, for a lot of reasons, and, and you know the, 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 that cylinder thing that I hate. Uh, it's hard to trap anybody. And it, If they pivot into you, it's a foul on you, even though they pivoted into you. So I think everybody's figured that out. We just got a long way to go defensively. We got we got a we got a gang guard more than what we do, and we don't rotate very well. You see it improving game to game. At times. It's better than it was when the season started, but it's still not it's still not what I think everybody's used to seeing. Coach uh Sagaball was, you know, pretty efficient. You know, fourteen point seventeen minutes. Uh you know, obviously the score the, the you know, game, you know, you take him out. Do you have to watch your I don't want to say limit his minutes, but do you kinda of have to, to, to watch battle that a little bit as you move? You know, further into December, January, February? Not really. I, they asked me about why didn't Beetle play more minutes. He didn't play more minutes because we trying to get Knapp and, and, and Jordan better. And it's the same way with Sags. You know, we know what Sags can do. You know, we got Jordan, uh, uh, Logan deserves to play. He, he he works his butt off, and we've got to continue to bring Andrew along. So it, it, it's not a matter of managing their minutes because of because of, of Sags's knee or Beetle's hand. It's more trying to get those other guys minutes when we can get them minutes because we're, we're now we're getting into the rest of the way here. Um, we're going to have to play our butts off to win. So, obviously, those guys are going to play more minutes. Was this a better offensive showing from Brandon Knapper? Uh, once he woke up, uh, he was uh, when he fir the first time he was in, he was he was just standing around, and, and then I thought the second time he went in, he was much much better. But you mentioned a couple times about looking at gapping and be playing some pack line principles. How hard would that be to do to put in? Considering you got to teach it to everybody during the season. We're pretty good at standing around, so. <laughs> um, we're just not doing what we do. What what we do, you know. I, you, you you get a guy in a trap. You can't let you can't let the guy closest to the ball catch it. You got to make the guy furthest away from the ball try to catch it. You know, you, 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 anytime you trap, you're you're playing four on three. Or they're they're playing four on three. So you have to you have to know who to rotate to. You have to you have to see you know where the guy's looking to pass the ball. I mean, it's it's not obviously not rocket science, but you. There's there's more to it than I think what people think there is, and and I I, I am serious. I I think the rules um, have negated um, defense. It's 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 everything to give the offense an advantage. Term Beetle, a natural born scorer. Mm. He put.
puts an enormous amount of time in, Bob. So I, I don't know. I mean, I, he's he's obviously got a great touch, but he he he's he's in the gym more than any of our guys are. Beetle gets off to that hot start. How important was that as far as getting some momentum early? I mean, they made some shots early that kind of kind of kept it a little closer than what I wanted it to be. But um, I don't know. I mean, it, it's if anybody makes a couple shots, it's good, right? We expect them to. If he gets open shots, he he's gonna make them. It's a matter of getting him open. And Jared was Jared was. Uh, was defensively was was doing some unusual things. Yeah. So it doesn't matter what what anybody does if you have good ball movement and you have good player movement. It's you're hard to guard. You're combining for almost uh, on pace for about ninety threes. Early on, I was just kind of wondering what you thought about that style of fight. Did that have to change at all? Or? Um, as long as we get step in threes, they're fine. You know, the one that the one that Sykes took at the end. You know, he's backing up. He's not going to make it. He's not going to get it over the rim. The one at West. West is running this way and then has to stop and turn around. He doesn't get it over the rim. When, when both of them step into shots, they make them. They only make they make the majority of them. But it's that it's that way with everybody. I mean, that's that's what that's what everybody strives to get. And the guys who can who can make shots as they're as they're turning or you know as they're going full speed or whatever are the guys that are the great scorers. We don't have we don't have a great scorer. But we have a lot of guys, if they take the right shots, they're going to make shots. They're going to make threes. Chase, Chase, uh, I talked to Chase the other day about just getting the ball up a little bit more because he was shooting it really flat. And then he got it up well early, and then he kind of went back to shooting it flat at the end. It's hard. It's hard to. It's hard to make a shot when the when the ball's going about the same same uh, height as the rim. It, it has a tendency to. And, and and I hate those because it's it just uh, one we can't rebound it and and two it's like a outlet pass. Bobby said so didn't turn over at all today, so pretty good with this the past couple of games. Slowing down it looks like. He's, yeah, he's, he's um, most of the time. Most of the time, uh, he gets a little stubborn sometimes. I've been trying to convince them that, and and there's there's a lot of statistical things to back it up that he plays much better when he doesn't have the ball in his hands all the time. He's really he, he's he's really good at cutting, and then you know then he was open a bunch early, and we didn't get him the ball. Nap didn't get him the balls, and that's that's why I got to play those guys. You know, I got to play. I got to get them some experience. Because you don't know. I mean, Beetle goes down again. It's it's going to be Knapp and Jordan, and you never you never know about those things. So we're trying to trying to get them as much experience as we possibly can. Ethan, uh, Ethan, and uh, Beetle kind of go together. I mean, you know, they they came in together. They're 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 they've gone through kind of similar careers almost. Uh, uh, how, how would you explain? Their journey so far, and what they what they have to do now to, to, to take take over this team. Well, Beetle, when Beetle hurt his elbow, um, I mean he was crushed. He was absolutely crushed. You know, he comes in as a freshman and tears his ACL. Uh, he's had all kind of injuries throughout throughout his time here, and. Um, he he just he really wants to play. I mean, it's just it, it, 
when when we were sitting him out of out of practice and stuff to try to get him healed up, he was he was emotional mess. He just he he loves to play. I think Issa doesn't show it quite as much as Beetle, but Issa loves to play too. I, I think that's the that's the thing that they both they both have in common. I mean, Beetle's one of those guys that he'll he'll play when he's probably 50. Here. Covington, probably. Yeah. Um, while, they, while they are different kind of people, they, they, this kind of is their team, isn't it? Mm -hmm. Trying to make it that. Trying to help them make it that. Yeah. The other guys respect them. Uh, and, you know, Beetle has the ball, obviously, a lot more than Issa, so. They, they they do look to Beetle. What kind of opportunity is this coming up on Tuesday for you guys? I think it's great that these guys get to experience playing in the garden. You know, I don't I don't really I don't remember a lot from my playing career, but I remember playing in the garden. I remember walking in the garden for the first time. The Knicks were finishing up practice when we walked in. It was, uh, you know, it is, it, I mean, what well, they say, it's called the Mecca. And, and I think that's where, that's where guys really develop rep reputations when they, when they play in, in that kind of atmosphere. This is, this will, this is the, this will be the game of the day, you know, and it, because it's Jimmy V and because all the, they're, they're, the, the Jimmy V game gets more publicity than probably any other three games or four games or whatever, because they're you know, they're still trying to raise money for to find a cure for cancer. I'm wondering if you could almost find out as much about your team in this game coming up than maybe you have over the last you know what was what's your If, if 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 we have everybody available, that that's 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 been the big if, you know. Uh, when when obviously you know Sykes makes a difference back there, and he's a guy you can throw it close to and score. And and Beetle is by far our our best point guard. He's got the most experience. He understands what's going. He understands you know pretty much things inside and out. The other guys are going to be good. It's just it's going to take a while. Well, what did you think of Jared's club? They were they were they were uh, a little more athletic than what it, they looked like on tape. Um, I, I I think it's I think it's the state of our game. Now, nobody passes the ball very well. Or really, nobody passes it. It's all. It everything is drive it, drive it, drive it, drive it, drive it. Everything. And it's to a large degree because of what they've done with the with the rules. We're we're going more and more European, which I don't understand. We invented the game. We wrote the rules for the game. We've been the best. We've been the, the best basketball country forever well, why do we want to be like them they should be like us I don't understand it anything else yeah Bob you mentioned the other day wanting to see more from from Sags offensively in the paint down on the block seemed like he got away from maybe drifting out of that a little bit today what was your impression well there's nothing wrong with him Drifting out there and, and shooting it, it's but he, he can't just do that, you know. He's got a, he is he's our best scorer uh, uh, from the block, and and he, he's he's we gotta we gotta get a couple things fixed with him, but but uh, you know he's he's as good a low post guy as as I don't think we've played anybody better than him.